Welcome back to another episode of Videos for Mom, where I play Legend of Zelda for my mom who can't anymore. Okay, so be warned, these videos are for her. If you want to sit in and join in with us, that's okay too. Just be fair warned. This is the fifth episode in the series, and in case you stumble across it, it is a largely unedited series. Meaning, for an hour straight, you're going to get nothing but gameplay and commentary. So, without further ado, let's go ahead and get started. So, hey mom. And uh, last episode I ended with this, but this episode I'm going to start with these guys. And these are the little amiibo things and the gifts they get. Remember they are, uh, whoops. You scared your horse. I did scare my horse. Bravo. <laughs> Remember they are just kind of nice little things you can get. Ooh, bananas. But you can only do it once per day. real life day. Not even in game day, just 24 hours. You're giving me lots of goodies here. Wait, talk to that person. After I open this. So maybe that's the person you need to talk to about changing stats or whatever for Raven. Nope, that's just a traveler. But that was my Twilight Princess Link. Now I got a couple more. Fang and Bone, keep an eye out for the special wares you can buy only at night. Now I got a couple more here. Okay. This is the uh, Rider Link. I can't remember what all he gives you. Oh! Looky there! Gives you a different kind of saddle. Maybe it'll have the bridle. Ah! And a bridle! Cool. And then the last one, which is the guardian. So, it's the big ass fuckers that shoot lasers at me. And they usually, <gasps> and they usually have like a guardian, like ancient swords and shit. Like that. Nice. Your I think cool. I can get in. <laughs> I think I can make room for that. Yeah. Oh, look, it's busted anyway. Fuck it. Guardian shields are pretty sick. I think it's funny. He just kicks it. <laughs> oh, no ancient arrows. A lot of arrows. It's okay. Sometimes it's not about getting ancient arrows. Well, ancient arrows are fucking nice, though. But. Alright, so that's all the mine amiibos, and so I'm gonna go ahead and equip that shield. Would you put that over there for me, sweetie? Yep. Alright, without further ado, let's go so ahead. I, I think you have to take a picture of your little action figures, things, amiibos, and show them to your mom. True. Very but only true. she knows exactly what they are, what they we'll look save, like. We'll save it until the actual episodes come out. Yeah, yeah. There we go. So I don't need that shield. I do need to go get my horse, though. Luckily, he didn't run off too far. He's no. Kind of... That poor guy having to lug that pack. For real, he does it to himself, though. Yeah. Oof. That was a shooting star. That was. Maybe you can get to it. Also, I did learn a little bit more about horses and how they act. Yeah, if they're uh, wild or whatever, that means that they'll always be kind of feisty. Well. I'll go ahead and go off the trail for now. Oh, I didn't mean for that. I swore it fell closer. I thought it did too. So what do you mean by you learn more about their behavior or whatever? Well, maybe behavior was the wrong word. But like, how their stats can line up, but what are really good horses and 
what they're good for. Yeah. Mmm, this is pushing it. Yeah, I wouldn't go much further. <clears throat> Do you see it anywhere? Mm -mm. Come on. I think you shouldn't go any further. I think you're right. I think we'll be pushing it. <clears throat> Don't worry, this is normal. Ah, uh, it's the blood moon. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so once a week everything responds. Yep. Be here, quit! Cats. I don't think you should go that way. I'm gonna try and make it up to this mountain. Yeah, I'm not going any further than that. That's a death fucking trap. So, okay. So what what makes a, a horse good? Well, you got three basic stats. Stat lineups for a really good horse. Oh. That's my cue not to go any further. See him? Those ones actually move. Yeah, and they suck. So, ride them, talk. Yeah. So, uh, I'm going to get the hell out of here. Try and make my way back to where <clears throat> I was. Well, that's another fucking stable. Are you going to make your way towards that? I might. Maybe not. Because it looks like it got across water. Mm. I need to find a bridge. That's all right, boy. Come on. There you go. Up the hill. There we are. Yeah. I'm not about to try and cross that river. No, it's pretty steep on the other side. Hey, come on now. So, continue. But, um, so you have three basic, like, archetypes of horses mm -hmm. that have for, you know, at least for stats. You can get one that's 445, which is a pretty, more horses, which is a pretty good overall average, you know, horse. Four, four, five. Yeah, four, oh, you... Uh, four speed, four strength, and four stamina, or five stamina. Mm. Pretty hardy, pretty quick, and you can use the little stirrups more regularly. Mm -hmm. Then there's a one that's got five for speed and like two for two or three for strength, yeah. with, you know, their health. Yeah. And then uh, three stamina. Mm. Well, he's a one. One in his strength, and then his speed and stamina were both pretty decent. He's got a speed of three and a stamina of four. Yeah. So he's a one, three, four? Well, that... That went weird. There you go. Now I can go talk to the person. I didn't mean to jump off like that. <laughs> and jump back onto the horse. That, right? that, that was, was uh... that was kind of impressive. 
I like watching the river flow by. Is that such a crime? Seeing the water stream so peacefully makes it hard to believe the Great Calamity really happened. Then monsters attack out of nowhere, and I think, all right, time to head back to the stables. Whatever. Uh... Poor girl. Well, at least you found your bridge. I mean, I could go that way. Mm. I'm not going to try for that one just yet. Now while I'm trying to train the horse, and I'm going to go ahead and head to... The dot? Kakariko, because I need to. So I'll just turn this horse around. Where's Kakariko? The dot. But you're going the opposite way. I, I know. See, I need to go here and then uh, around. Okay. I'm going with the way it was, it's, it's kind of guiding you. Mm. Oh, fun fact, the horse will take the path by itself. I don't have to guide it. So, it's doing that by himself. I have to guide him in the forks. Yeah, because you got to tell him which work to take. Yeah. So this isn't a bad horse. It's not a great horse, but it's not a bad horse either. Well, I'm sure you'll find another one that you really like that's got really good stats. I'm sure I will. I'm so ah. sad, though, because paints are usually some of the lowest stat horses, aren't they? They are. And I love paints. You know how hard... Stop. Ooh. Stop. Stop. What are you doing? Chill, horse. Bug. Did you see that? Yeah, he did. <laughs> oh. Well, he is pretty wild. Oh, dear. Oh. Oh. Nice. Soldier's bow is badly damaged. I thought I was using another one. Ah, shit. Oh, well. Well, look at your bows and see. I meant to be using one of these. Oh, well. You stay here. I don't know. I don't need you getting damaged. No. <laughs> or at least I think strength has to do with their health, but I'm not 100% sure. It does. It the does. higher the strength set, the more damage they can take. Okay. Mm he didn't get to blow the horn. Sometimes it's not about hitting him once. Sometimes it's about hitting them multiple times where it hurts. Not going to try the box trick again? Oh, yep. Mm -hmm. It works. it works with the weak ones. Yeah, whenever you get the blue ones, that's when it gets kind of fucky. Yeah. <laughs> it's like... <laughs> I, just, I just like watching them get hit and they're like... Wah! Oh, this is so good. Oh, that's so good. Yeah, I think the only way that this would be better is, you know how t uh, Penguin made that hot chocolate for us? Yes, that was good. Make it that way and then add the pumpkin spice into it. Mmm. That's good. Good tea? Very good tea. Ooh, that's yummy. Is he close enough to hear you? Yep, there he goes. Look at him. I often choose not to engage in battle on horseback. I don't blame you. God, he's pretty. Yeah? Can you find, like... I think the only way he... Like, the less white he might possibly get, or a horse you could find similar to him with less white, is if it didn't have white on its face. Probably. Because he has a white stripe on his face. There's a blue one. These ones you've killed before, I remember this. Mm-hmm. <laughs> oh, look at the blue one run. What the? What? What was your health? 
full. Holy shit, what kind of weapon is he using? Probably a soldier's broadsword. I wasn't expecting that either, because he kind of just like... One-shotted you? That was... Well. Try this again. Watch out this time. Yep. Shit. Yep, it is. Yep. I think I can find something to get rid of that. Or get rid of for that. That's a pretty good weapon. Shit. <laughs> well. You got a lot of really decent weapons. Did you forget? Mm-hmm. Well, I won't be needing that for a while, so... this video that I thought might be interesting. Yeah. You're analyzing which one's more effective in Assassin's Creed Stealth for just using the sword. Mm -hmm. And I'm pretty sure they got two people who have barely even played the game before to try out each, each style and I'm just like, yeah, no. I have no idea what you're talking about. In my experience, I mean, with the other Assassin's Creed, you with the fight system, you can just go in there and be like, Parry! Kill! Parry! Kill! Parry! Kill! So you kill, 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 kill. <laughs> So, stealth really just kind of made you feel uh -huh. better about yourself as an assassin, whereas if you did get found out, I mean, especially in Black Flag, eventually I just kind of dropped the facade and just like, I'm not an assassin, I'm a pirate. Fuck this shit. shit. Hmm. What? Another camp. Have you not been to this one before? Nope. This is the furthest this direction I've been. In this game, anyway. Yeah. Stay. <laughs> it's like one guy was just like, oh, there's lions here. I'll set them free, and then I'll fight the other guys. And he breaks the cages, and the lions start to attack him. He's like, don't attack me, I freed you. And I was like, of course they're going to attack you, the fucking wild animals. You do that at a distance. That's a stealth thing. Ah, it's a blue! Nope, didn't mean to do that. Ah, fuck me in the asshole. Oh, well. That worked. Okay. You fucking threw that you little asshole? Sick. Yeah. Cheeky dick waffle. Any more? That's a new one. What? Cheeky dick waffle. Well. <laughs> that's from uh, oh, no, that's from a uh, Helsing. I mean, it's, not, it's not that new. I know, but you don't really say that one. I do not. That's why I need some more meat. Oh, that's all there was, though. Damn, no chest. Right? Oh, well. Other goodies. Well, that's saddening. This is just like a big old fuck you. At least my horse didn't die. No, he just ran by. I don't know how he called. I thought I'm. I didn't even come close to that button, but oh well. He's alive. Whew. Mm-hmm. I'm sorry, I just realized you guys were recording. That's okay. Do, 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 do. Well, they have... All these uh, little Koroks. They have those cartoons that uh, have, like, all the superheroes sitting at a diner and, like, talking to each other. And Batman says all the time, Because I'm Batman. 
They have another show that they kind of start after the whole Heroes Diner thing called The Villain's Pub, where it's basically like a bar where all the villains come and talk to each other. Huh. And I just watched and last an, one. I just watched an episode where uh, Batman busted in there was just like, Time for the ultimate boss battle. <laughs> and started bad writing everywhere. Jesus. Like, Voldemort tried to uh, get away, and then Batman pulled out a wand that had like a bat thing at the end, and he was like, something, something, and he reappeared, and he's like, what the fuck? <laughs> Buddy's part, though, was at the end where they technically captured him because his weakness is women. Which makes sense, because he's like, oh no, I trust them too much. Do you want to know my secret identity? And then Harley's just like, whack! <laughs> And they chain him up, and they're about to feed him to Jaws. Jaws. And then, like, it cuts back to them in the dining. He's like, and then I escaped. How? Because I'm Batman. Cause I, yeah, because I'm Batman. <laughs> I saw that one coming. And then Is it, that it, a hole? Mm-hmm. In the bottom of the seat. Oh, there's nothing in that. Oh, you got to push the boulder. Yep. <laughs> it showed how he actually got out. A little hole opened up, and Doctor Strange was just like, popped out. <laughs> So yeah, Batman got saved by Doctor Strange. Well, you should only hit it once. You know, that's, that's I, like doing a drive at a mini golf course. Why? Why would you hit it like three times? Well, previous times I hit it, it only it barely moved. Yeah, I'd rather nudge it instead of trying like fucking swing it in from a distance. Okay. And you just scared your horse. Oh well. Uh, as long as he's not hurt. Okay, now just again. give it one hit. Okay. There. Hey. <laughs> beep, beep. More goblins. More goobin. Oh, the other part was a. Nice. I, I totally escaped. So you're saying that next time you want to stay? Oh yeah, I barely got out of there alive. <laughs> Ow! That fucking fires are so many of them with these good ass swords. Because you have good equipment, they have to have good equipment. Ah, damn it! They must be killing a lot of knights or something recently. Man, they got soldier swords, so That's some good maybe. tea. Either that or they've started to actually go through their own goblin industrial revolution. Oh, you have to get it again? No, I knocked it in already. Okay. This one on the other hand. That's party. Come on. Come on, biggin. The amounts of retries. In this episode. There you go. Fucker. I can't say how much I'm still getting used to Assassin's Creed stuff. Especially whenever they have kind of a longer weapon and your dodge doesn't exactly go far enough. Oof. That's another fucking good sword. Yeah, but you have no room for it. I know. Unless you're, you're going to get rid of your sledgehammer. Sledgehammers are nice. I know. Ooh. Soldier shield. Get rid of the one you got. <laughs> yep, because it's damaged. Whee! Nope. You dropped the wrong one. Yep. <laughs> I can't believe you're getting all this sh soldier shit already. I can't either, to be honest. That That's pretty good shit. Buckle. Buckabo. I still love saying it. Book Come on, boy. Book a bow. Here he comes. Very nice. That mount is flawless. That was not. Huh. That seemed like a very specific little flower. I think they're pretty rare. It looks pretty rare. You were lucky you spotted it. Kinda. 
Let's go around this big ass hill. Oh, I see the little boat. What are those things called? The little imps. Boat goblins? No, no, no. Not goblins. The little things you get the seeds from. Koroks. Koroks. Are they supposed to be little fairies or something? Kinda. The little force people. Hey, you a traveler? Grab a spot by the fire if you'd like. I'm a traveling merchant. Name's Jiro, Giro, whatever. Nice to meet you. Crazy times to live in, eh? Go into the forest all on my own to get my wares. But there are far safer ways to get them, such as buying them from travelers like you. So, do you happen to have anything rare you've been interested in selling? Maybe. <laughs> Let's see. What do I have a lot of I could spare? So is this Those one like the fallout of teeth? Zelda? Yes. Yep. Let's see, I got 57. Let's sell 37. Leaves me with 20. Look at that money rack up! Uh, let's do the same thing. Let's sell... 57? 67. See? I mean, I still got plenty of items left. Oh, yeah. Uh, key swing. Three. I think all the rest you're... I'll keep. Yeah. What do you got? Mm. Truffle, carrot, arrow, salt. Know where to get another woodcutter's axe if you need one. Exactly. There's my next major destination. Getting about there. It's just kind of nice to get a horse and just ride. Yeah, trot along. Actually, I guess it would be a canter. Yeah. Well, canter, gallop. Man, tomato. They're fairly similar. Because mm. the trot is very rough. They're doof, 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 doof. Gallop, it's a lot smoother like what you were doing. And then the dead on run. I am true. Hmm. Hmm. Another axe. So I know where to get them. <gasps> oh my goodness, Bagheera. They're on crack. Yep. It's that time of night. That spicy thing. That that tea is fucking good. Oh, if yeah. there's a way up there. Uh, can, nope, those aren't metal boxes. Those are kids. You gotta say. Glide. Oh, wait, I got an idea. Climb up there and glide all the way up over yep. there? Yep. <laughs> so this is gonna take me to. here. swimmers in this game? can't remember. Some of the, I can't remember if they'll actually swim or if they won't even go into the water. They might not go into the water at all. Some horses won't. Mm, exactly. You know what are good swimmers? That hippo who almost ate me! <laughs> Very nice hit. No. Between the horns from the back of the face. Oh, sweet Jesus, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> it takes me halfway up, so... I'm not gonna complain. Nice little cheat. <laughs> I'm just glad that there's, like, handles here. 
So even though it's raining, you don't slide down. Yeah. If you're trying to climb a rock wall, you'd be you, Yeah, you, you literally just slide. Which would make sense. Ask me how I know. You've done it. I, I fucked up many a climb because I decided, hey, I'll do it while it's raining. It's like, oh, wait. This is a bad idea. This is a horrible idea. Yeah, it was a very, very bad idea. And stem was up. Ooh. And last bit. Ooh. I see that smirk. I make it look easy. You too I say before I promptly almost eat my tea bag. <laughs> I guess I made that look easy too, to be fair. I always work good at swallowing. Oh my god, Bagheera! Apparently our... Did you find the catnip? Jesus! Apparently our cat's on a bit of a... binge. <laughs> Her and Diego were sitting there playing! I know. That's weird! She doesn't play with Diego! It's very weird. It was kind of cute. She was standing on the black chair, Nate, and he was standing on the brown chair. And she reached over and pawed at him, and he pawed at her over the chair. And now, but they weren't kissing. We have a lift off. Oh. That's weird. Usually, she's a lesbo cat. Oh, well, she and was licking Kilala earlier. So when I'm near a sensor, or near a shrine, the little slate will go bing, 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 and let me know. Nice. It's kind of handy. Can you also mark them from up here? Yep. It's trying to tell me there's one nearby. Which I mean there's a couple. <clears throat> now, which I think they're are you up fly there. To? That way. That didn't go the way I wanted it to. He did not jump. That's okay. You'll still make it. Yeah, it looks like I'll make it, hopefully. I'm gonna be kinda upset if there's nothing up here. Doesn't look like there's anything up here. Hey, it looks like I'm kind of upset. <laughs> Somebody running. Don't you fucking do it. Oh, I like how they're taking shelter. What do you got? It's raining fierce out. Guess I'll have to take cover for a while. But even though I'm wet to the bone, meat waits for no one. He sells meat. Huh. Let's see what So he's got raw meat, raw prime, prime meat. meat, raw bird drumstick, and raw bird thigh. Hmm. Interesting. That's about it. That's also I'm shiny. <laughs> Find the box. Oh, Torch. okay. Right, Just Raven. making sure, because I saw the shiny. <clears throat> Let's go, bud. So is there a bridge or something that's going to take you across? That'd be nice, wouldn't it? Right there, we're trying. Mm hmm. What the hell? Oh, lizard men. This is pretty funny to watch. <laughs> as long as it works, right? I've been playing in Assassin's Creed too long. Shit. I saw, I saw them as crocodiles. Mm -hmm. Ouch. <laughs> now go get your stuff before it floats away. For real, dude. Ah, got it. Oh. 
Hope it's good. One last pull. Okay. Shoot. Oh, this beeping. I'm about to get the shrine. Right there. I know. You can use bombs, but bombs have a tendency to fling that shit everywhere. Everywhere. And so I try to... Avoid doing that as much as I don't even know. Traveler's bow broke. I think I tried to climb up here while it was raining. While it was raining, and I kept having fucking issues, and I couldn't fucking figure out that it was because of the rain. <laughs> because I'm a dingus like that. It took me a few tries. Yeah. Well, I mean, what game before this has ever done that? Made it harder to climb during the rain. I know, usually it's just a non issue. Yeah. Even a game, uh, Shadow of the Colossus used to play a lot. When rain it didn't, yeah, rain didn't affect you. Yep. I want to get the new one that mm. they made. Last Guardian? Yeah. Looks very interesting. I don't think I like this one, if I remember right. It's a very heavy puzzle. Well, they're all kind of, Well, not all of them are heavy puzzle, but I think this one has... a tinge of... If you don't get the timing right, you're screwed. More or less. No, I remember that one where you had to fling the ball after getting it through the maze. That look you gave me. Like, That's the one I'm thinking of. Yep. Uh, it's not this one. God, that fucking sucked. Coming up. Smooth like butter. I'm not gonna like it that you're on her teeth. Yeah. Because she'd be too scared to say anything. She'll be fine. Maybe that's where she's getting it from. Maybe there's something in that tea. Which one? Maybe. I don't know, but yours on the box. Oh, also tea boxes. Oh no, what am I gonna do? Oh fuck, I really oh no, what am I gonna do? Thank you, shit. Uh, ice? With what water? Oh, you have to have water? Go to have water. You're a waterbender in the M. Night Shyamalan movie? Shut up. There you go. You glad Actually, it? technically, to be fair, waterbenders had to have water anyway. Think about it, firebenders are actually the only one that could create fire or their element from their own body. Ah. At least for the most part. You could do other shit that's
It's always easier than it looks. Oh, hell yeah. It was worth it. Not in the hood. Now you need to get Damn, it, it feels good to be a gangster. Ah. Like, you're going to have to get on the thing. War. Well. No, I won't. There's always an easy way. Fuck shit. God, what <laughs> the hell? <laughs> Stairs, man. Stairs. They're killer. I ain't no shit. Uh, skip. Yum, bum, 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 bum. Up to three. I'm just glad these fuckers heal you. They do? Mm-hmm. I didn't know that. Whenever you get a spirit orb, you get your health filled. Nice. Field. Here. Give this a shot. No, give it a shot. It's going to be probably too strong. You're absolutely right in that regard. Yeah, but yeah, that climbing bandana allows me to climb just a little bit faster. Is that it? Just rock salt? I feel cheated. I <coughs> <sighs> see, last time I played, I didn't even have a horse this early. It means I walked all the way through here. Why don't you take them play a brand? Yes and no. Swam. Wow, that didn't kill them? I'm surprised. Where the hell is that one going? Trying to find the easiest way over. Good luck with that. Right. You know what? I'll be right there, guys. Is there a reason for that? I can't help but feel like there is, but I don't know. <laughs> hmm. Only a couple apples. Huh. You'll never be rid of me, Pyro. <laughs> Alright. Before we take on this shrine, let's go ahead and deal with this camp. Oh, they already went to sleep. Yeah, they're not, uh... Bright. Yeah. 
Then again, I did kind of move on, so. Boomerang. They're cool, but ultimately not necessary. It is cool to have a, like, tossable, returnable weapon now. Anything over here worth looking at? Stick. Spear. Torch. Stick. Throwing spear. Throwing stick. Throwing spears are pretty neat. They're really fun to throw. Like, more so than normal weapons. Like your iron sharpened iron sticks? Yes. Or your large thick sticks? Or your sticks that shoot other sticks? All those large spiky sticks right there. It's true. <sighs> Jackass, is that too? Oh, yep, that was right. Can't remember what this one is. I don't think this is a hard one, no. Wonder if it involves sticks. Ah, that is so good. Ah, oh, water. Okay. That weird liquid sticks. Look how cold those ice cubes really are. Hmm. I mean, it, it's ice, but I don't think it's actually cold. It's magic. Ice. Yes. <clears throat> So you never know. Can you turn that thing? Ah, uh, I see you gotta block it. Like you said, I think no. Nintendo is trying to up their game because oh. all the shit we've been seeing with Odyssey. And then this. Aww. Damn, I have up to three. Mm hmm. Great goddess of Boop. magic. Boop. How many cubes can yeah. this item give? Three. No more, no less. Oh, thank you. I didn't want to. Like, just kinda like, no. You know like in those movies where you see like them shoot for a basketball goal mm -hmm, and you see the ball just go around the rim forever and it's like, you son of a bitch. Anytime uh, that situation comes up, I always think of Happy Gilmore. Is go your to home your home. home! Is it too good for you? Alright, where's there, the chest? Is there a chest in this one? There's always a chest. Not always. Always. This one was pretty um, straightforward, I think. Most of them are. When you wrap your head around it. But there's always. <laughs> there's always loot. There's always a. Ch ah! Oh, it goes just as quick. Tell me about it. Yeah, 
Yeah, but you don't really spend your rupees all that much. Doesn't find anything he's wanted yet. <laughs> Game's just starting, my love. Good point. And I found all of what, like, two or three merchants? Yeah. You haven't found a clothes merchant yet. And spikes are gone. No, he does not move that fast. He's just found in these places. Well, who's to say it's the same one? Because his name's Beetle. Oh. Like Dummy Beetle? Just Beetle. Well, he kind of reminds me of Dung Beetles, because Dung Beetles move, you know, things that are so much bigger than them. I'm not saying, you know, anything bad about mm -hmm. him, just, just, that's what it kind of reminds me of. But there are still monsters wandering around, and the area near Hyrule Castle is especially dangerous. If you're going to be traveling, you should know a thing or two about elixirs. I'll do a refresher. You can get them by mixing bugs and other small creatures with monster parts. Most of them are no good for refilling your health, but they can have a lot of unique effects. Some can increase your speed, raise your resistance to extreme temperatures, and blah blah blah. It's like cooking. They won't mind if a few things. A few apples go missing. Well, maybe they do mind a little bit, but I don't care. What are y'all saying? Looks like it to me, judging from his eyes, he's just itching to get into the saddle. You're right, he's got eyes that just say, like, nothing in this world matters to me except horses. That means... That means... We've got a customer... Horse, 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 okay. Yeah, we just talked about that in this episode, actually, so. Yep. And I don't need to know how to train them or anything. I pretty much got that figured out. Rain! What are you doing? We'll talk later. Uh, I think he's just explaining it. Yeah. Yeah. Basically, moon turns red, everything comes back to life. It kind of already explained that. What do you got to say? Have you ever been to Kakariko? They've got great food, clothes, and it ain't cheap. Selling a few things I picked up on my travels doesn't cost a look. Let's take a sneak peek. Uh... They get a few more. Sell. Thank you. Oh, not enough. To make much of a difference? Yeah. I usually wait. Sell it all in bulk later. Yep. These little guys have a quest, as you could tell. As you could tell. From their little... Well, fuck. Usually they have that little red thing. Well, they did whenever you first looked at them, but then you walked past them. Yeah. So I've got the scoop on Misko's treasure, and it's great. Listen up. You're not supposed to sit there and listen to them. You're supposed to mm. be kind of sneaky. Maybe. Yeah, 
Can we go around? You can give dogs steaks and they'll go and give treasure for you. That's okay, pretty you neat. give me treat, I give you treat. Yep. Let me see if I can. Should have paid attention. Miss Ghost Treasure. Okay. So you just talk to them again. So, this is a side quest, obviously. We're after nothing less than the treasure of Misko the Great Bandit. Finding it would mean incredible riches. I'm not about to give this information away for free. Oh. See, uh, nice thing about being me. If you uh, come up here, believe. Yeah, we follow this. It's over here. You already know where it is. I do. You don't have to pay. I don't. Hi. Let me see. Horses. Okay, so yeah, nothing new there, but this is where I got my first horse. Are you gonna go check out and see some of their horses around here? I could possibly catch one and check it out. Take a peek at them. Mm. I'm gonna try and grab this real quick. There's three of them. It's cricket. Another cricket. Nice, it hopped right to you. Another cricket. Nice. So let's try and find one horse and see what kind of stats it's got. Oh, look, there's three, four. All right, pick one, babe. Uh, Not the paints. I know. They've got a gray one, and I can't tell what the other one is. Brown? That brown one's in the lead. I know, I'm kind of got my eye on that brown one. Or black one. Looks pretty. Mm hmm. Take that one. Because it's in the lead. I like the way it looks. Maybe that's something else. Like, maybe if they're the lead horse, that means, you know, better stats. Could be worth a check. I wish you could grab a paint. I grabbed a paint as my first one, named it Oreo. It was black and white. It was black and white. Oh, don't split the gray one. It wasn't that great. Yeah, I know. Pisses me off. Why do they have to hate the paints? I don't know. I love paints. I find it interesting that that's like a green horse. The gray one? Yeah. Yeah, it's kind of a greenish gray. It's not actually gray. <laughs> Fucking stop moving. No. I'm just glad this grass is really fucking tall. This thing does not want to stop. Come on. What sucks about it being in the lead is that it's kind of got a backup. Yeah. That one's kind of like a dark gray. It's not black. Come on. Stop moving! That's, what, that's exactly what I'm thinking. It's like, don't oh, stop there's more. fucking moving. Oh. It's got a twin. Stop. 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 Yes. Turn to me. Come to daddy. Gotcha! 
Oh, soon, 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 soon. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, bitch. I like your spirit, though. Get him. Yeah. Oh, he's away from the others. That makes this easy, actually. He had a doppelganger. Did you see that? I did. So if this one sucks... Maybe go test out the other one? Yep. Come on. <sighs> this one, man. I, w I was hammering on that L, so... I'm just saying this one, because this one does not want to quit moving. It's a good one. I like it. I like the way it looks. I like it spunk. Oh, come on. You're not making this easy on me. You're almost there. Nice and calm. Gotcha! Come, 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 come. Shh, shh, shh. Oh, my. Damn! Hey, now. I think I got me a winner. This one kicked you off twice. Oh, he's coming towards you. Crouch. Face it head on. He's gonna run. <laughs> oh yeah, they'll fucking it fucking hit hurts whenever they hit you. Gotcha. Three times. Ooh. Pretty. I like you. Raven's a good horse. But maybe this one's better. Come on. Four stamina. So it's got the same stamina as him? Mm-hmm. Let's see. Oh, oh. That's the exact same. Well, let's go look at your clone, shall we? So take me over to your clone. That's so sad because it is. Do they get spooked by you riding another horse? Probably. But now that you've mellowed that one out, um, you can just kind of get back on it, can't you? Yep. It's the exact same as my other horse. Damn it. All right, let's try you. Because I like the way you look. I want you. Please be good. Ah. <laughs> uh, that was an awfully easy tame. That was because I fucking spammed the hell out of that button. Ugh. Nope. Already, I'm just like, no. Maybe that brown one or maybe even the green one? Spicy peppers. And the gear. That green one booked it. Yeah, it did. Take, check the brown one. I know that's not your favorite color, but... Not by a long shot. And this is going to be the one that's like 5-5-5. Five, five, five. Is there a five 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 horse? No. Okay. <laughs> well, yeah, but it's a temporary mount. Temporary? Yeah. Ah. <sighs> well, well, this one's got four. Yep. Yeah. You're gonna have this whole herd team. <laughs> just, to, just to look at their stats. Yep. Yeah. But they're they're not hard to tame. What do you got? Hmm? Fuck you! Ah! <sighs> well, looks like Raven is uh my mount of choice still. Well, you can check the green one if you want. Eh, let's check the green one. Why not? I think he made... Oh, wow. He's... He's all the way over there. I don't know, would you see all the other horses over here? Huh. Um, not Wait, a big fan. There's only two browns. Ah. 
Uh. Nope. Damn. They'll go back to being wild, won't they? Yeah, yeah. I mean, you, as long as you don't register them or anything, they'll. It's it's whatever. Well, looks like you're still it, Raven. All the others just. All are the others the suck. same or worse. Yep, but that's my time limit for today. So thank you, everyone, for tuning in. Hope you enjoyed, Mom. Hope you enjoyed this episode as well. Uh, I know I'm picky, but I like really good horses. So, anyway, thank you guys. I'm Crash. I'm Fox, and we'll catch you guys next time. See you in the next episode. Love you.